sex with a snow bunny officer. What city, brothers and sisters? We're talking about the five police and the snow bunny. We're talking about the five police and the snow bunny. What city was that? Five black cops, five black cops were all sleeping with the same snow bunny officer. Five black police were all having with the same snow bunny and they all got fired. They lost their job and probably their career because they could not help themselves from bunny hopping. So you got to go home and tell your wife and children. You got to go home and tell your wife and children that I was having casual random with a snow bunny at my job. I was having random casuals with four other black men. With a group of other black men. And I got fired. Sleeping with a white girl. We that crazy. Over snow bunny cookies. That a whole group of black men slept with the same white girl and kept sleeping with the same white girl. And now you lost your job. What the hell is wrong with us? I don't think the snow bunny lost her job. Did the snow bunny lose her job? I don't think the snow bunny lost her job. I don't think her snow, the snow bunny lost her job, but the black men did. The black men did. That's what you get. First of all, she married. First of all, she married. Black or white, she married. You had no business touching her. But I'm trying to understand the psychology. Because I'm not going into no loosey-goosey. So this is a snow bunny loosey-goosey. This is a snow bunny police loose goose. She got a loosey-goosey. And you trifling ninjas. You trifling ninjas kept going into a Lucy Goosey Snow Bunny. And y'all kept doing it so much, going into the Lucy Goosey. So y'all sleeping with her, her white husband sleeping with her. Y'all spreading germs, bacteria, diseases, going home to your wife and girlfriends. You got sloppy with it. You raw dogged the bunny. You raw dogged a bunny. And lost your damn career over a loosey goosey from a snow bunny police officer. You should be ashamed. Brothers and sisters, I'm going to be starting a petition. I'm going to be starting a petition to undo the 1967 Loving versus Virginia Supreme Court decision. I want to overturn the Supreme Court decision. I want them to revisit it. I want interracial marriage to be illegal in the United States. I want interracial marriage between black and anything else. It can stay legal for everybody else. But for black people, we are too psychologically damaged. For African people, we are too psychologically damaged. And I am starting a petition to reverse the Supreme Court decision of June 1967. I want it reversed. We must make interracial dating between black men and black women and all other races illegal. We must do this to save the black family. We have nothing against the white woman. I respect you, white women. I respect you, Chinese women. I respect you, Latina women. I respect you, East Indian women. I respect you, Mexican women. I respect you, Arab. I have nothing against you. But to save my community, in order to save my race, we have to make bunny hopping a federal offense. Bunny hopping must become a federal offense. Offense. I want to introduce 
the anti snow bunny hopping bill into Congress. No Negro is allowed to date, live with, sleep with, reproduce, cohabitate, engage, or marry with a non-African woman. We can help the community this way. We can help the community this way. Let's sign the petition and reverse the Loving versus Virginia Supreme Court decision in order to save our community. Those brothers are an embarrassment to the race. Then we got some more brothers. I got a question. Did the other brothers beat him up or did they kill him? Who killed Tyree? Rest in peace. Was Tyree murdered by black police? Somebody help me. Was Tyree murdered by black police? Was Tyree murdered by black police? Was Tyree, your boss tell you what to do every day, Marquise. Don't get cute for I block you, bro. Your boss tell you what to do every day. You're used to it. Question, who killed, was Tyree killed by black cops? Yes, Memphis, okay. They all got fired. And they should have got fired for taking the life of a black man. But what it also shows you is that there's a double standard for every black person. White police kill black people, they go home. White police kill black people, they go home. White police kill black people, they go home. Black people kill black people, they lose their job, and they should. You five brothers, how many was it, four or five? You are a disgrace to the race. You're a disgrace to the race. Absolutely. You had no right to take that man's life. We need black police. We need black police, but we need black police who love their people. We need black police who love their people. We don't need Europeans in blackface. We don't need no damn Oreo officers. We don't need no Oreo officers going to work with a white mentality and something to prove and killing and beating on black folks to prove to white people they can be trusted. We don't need black police killing black people to prove to white police you can be trusted. We don't need black police killing black people to prove to white people you can be trusted. Black police are an embarrassment right now. I hope all the other black police, I hope y'all watching this. I hope y'all not bunny hopping and I hope you ain't terrorizing your own people. Black police, I support black police who know how to treat black people with respect and concern. I respect black police. I support black police who know how to treat black people with respect and concern. Please don't be out there bunny hopping and don't be terrorizing your own people. First time I ever got cursed out by a police, it was a black police. I was only like the fifth grade. 